here is a world exclusive of a new 10 inch tablet. This is the Shogo, the tablet uh, by Real Ease. And uh, I'm here at the Freescale European headquarters in Toulouse. And uh, I'm going to show you how it is. I'm even going to open it up. It has features not before seen. Uh, it has a camera, it has three USB ports, uh, two internal, one external. It has Ethernet right here, headphones, microphone. Uh, it even has a kickstand, so you can see right here, you can put it on the, on the table. Uh, so let's open it up and let's check out the software right now. So I'm going to show you now the user interface of this tablet. And um, so here's the 10 inch tablet. It's powered by Freescale uh, processor, the IMX37. And they also have a version with the IMX51. So it's totally going to be available really, really soon. And uh, in August, they're shipping the IMX37 version. And it's based on a WebKit browser right here in Linux. And uh, let's, let's go and sit in here. I'm going to show you some interface. So let's check it out. Um, there is, so there's a browser. And they have, uh, right here is an example, they have a basic user interface for the, for the HTML5 based applications. Uh, I don't know if they're all based on HTML5, but uh, the point is that developers can make their app in HTML5 and load it onto this device, and uh, they can limit the use of the of the tablet if they want. If they want to have some specific market, if you want to, if you're on an airline, for example, or if you are um, a taxi company, or if you are a, a, ho a hotel chain. And if you want to provide this as a as a special like interface with all your de hotel designs and all that, or if you are uh, like for example some store, some IKEA or some some stores like that supermarket, you can have a special af application that people can make using HTML5 and just load on it. You can also use Qt, and if you want, uh, you can also have Android running on it, and uh, uh, with Flash support of course because it's, this is a Freescale processor. So I'm going to just uh, show some example of some of the things that they have right here. So it's um, it's a pretty powerful system. So it's based on the on the Freescale processor. It's just about to be released. Uh, you have two internal. I'm just going to open it up in in ten seconds. I'm going to open it up so you can see how it is inside. Uh, oh yeah, there's a motion sensor right here. That's pretty cool. Um, so basically, you can have a software that that only turns it on or turns the screen on when somebody's in front of it and that's a really good way to save some power so you can just stand uh, it can always be there and you can have um, uh, like a motion sensor there's also the ambient light detectors so here uh, I would like to demonstrate the special interface that they have uh, developed uh, uh, that just runs on top of, of Linux right here and so they this is the same platform that's right here which they have launched in France they call it the cook and uh, so it's specialized this this whole tablet is just about showing you recipes and that's the whole idea is that if you have a, a, a very specialized application idea if you're a big company if you order, order many thousands of these you can contact real ease directly and they can customize the design for you they can make this cool looking design check it out there it has pods so you can actually put it on your kitchen table and it doesn't get greasy and you can do all kinds of colors whatever you want and uh, so that's the idea is uh, get a custom tablet release.com uh, down to $350 if you order many and uh, that's the idea check it out